So in today's video, I'll be showing you my setup for recording tennis matches. So it's very basic, pretty inexpensive, and very adjustable. Now this is the camera mount I've been using for like 90% of my uh, matches. It's the Delkin Fat Gecko Vice camera mount. Could be had on Amazon for $28. I'll provide the link in the description. As you can see, it has a vise with a screw that you could attach to the fence or, or even one of those hanging poles. And it has the camera mount attached to a two inch spacer that connects to a ball joint. This way you can make uh, your adjustments. But what makes this really adjustable is what I mounted to. I mounted to the handle of a racket I could make my adjustments at my level. I could work without reaching up high. And as you can see in the video, I could place this tennis racket into the holes of the fence at any level, pretty much any angle. I could mount this to the fence securely without risk of it falling. So this method of attaching it to the racket, I could just peg hole it into any fence behind the court, put it at center line, put it off center line, put it at um, true court level height, or even get the TV quote unquote camera angle high up perspective on the court by just placing it up higher in the fence. And this is what makes this totally quick and easy and totally adjustable. Sometimes when it's a nice looking location, I like to get a little corner view from the court to me it adds a little uniqueness to the tennis shot rather than the center line straight back one now this works with basically any fence because most times all tennis courts are surrounded by fences and even fences with windscreens that are on the opposite side of the fence now you're kind of out of luck if the windscreen is on the inside of the fence or if the windscreen is very tight and you could get the can't get the racket through even if it's a little semi snug you can still get that racket through there if you got a couple of inches to work with but when the windscreen's on your side of the fence it's a problem but usually they have view windows or air vents and you can use those spots to get the racket in may not be your most desirable um, camera location on the fence but it does the job this clamp should do the job for 95% of the scenarios you'll face while trying to record your match. Now, if you found this video helpful or interesting, please like and subscribe. Helps me out tremendously building the channel and check out my other tennis content. I hope you stick around. Thanks for watching.